Okay, uh, it's been a week or two, but I've completely reworked the software and electronics behind the pen screw and some of the integration between that. We're down a bunch of bugs and I'm gonna try again. This is first test, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I already have tool one. This is a three color drawing. I have the first color already in there, so it should just start drawing the first shape, do a couple exchanges and finish it here in a minute. Let's go ahead and see what happens. Oh, it's performing a tool change because I have it in that mode. It's going to drop off pen one and pick pen one back up again. Uh, it's kind of a thing I have it for testing mode to allow me to test things, but that's fine. God damn it. <laughs> I just had to do the tool change, that's all I had to do. Alright, let's, uh, we got that out of our system, let's go ahead and, uh, Do another tool change, I guess. I'm just gonna start this and see what happens. Um... Gotta make sure the tool change works, I suppose. Do you have a new calibration procedure for uh, the pen, the screw that clamps onto the pen? I uh, added a, a little limit switch. I just have it do a quick calibration between each uh, pick up and drop off. Hi, cat. Keyboard's always in the way.
That's it. That's, uh, that is a three color drawing. Uh, a few other things I've implemented is I have a return pen function uh, I put into the UI. Let's see if it works. have uh oh yeah calibrates i also put in a just an explicit clamp and unclamp button which just kind of calls my movement function for this particular motor and uh also a calibration button just to put it into calibration mode uh yeah oh uh, work in progress um I mean, it tests well, but currently some of the, some of it's kind of outputted into this Arduino, which is handling the, uh, the stepper motor that closes clamps on the pen, which I do actually have an actual driver, which runs it a lot better than, uh, these kind of little 3d printer drivers that I was kind of first testing with, but I do need to kind of harden all this and not have a breadboard. I guess, but that is, that's uh, stuff to do later. All right, well, see you later, YouTubes.